Hey, we're back. Uh, you know, I know this is kind of probably not a very exciting playthrough. I apologize for that. Uh, that's my fault, I think, for just sticking with action stuff. Uh, but if you're still around, thanks for watching. It probably means um, maybe that this channel is huge. People are just going back and watching horrible old stuff of mine. But I highly doubt that as well. I did take a break. This is the next day for me. And I kind of don't exactly remember what we were doing. A little time went by just on the, the video because I was uh, setting up the recording window and stuff and uh, uh, clicking and uh, some time went. And uh, I think we finished up our sales on, uh, I think, Duty Cart was what was going on. Our Call of Duty uh, Cart uh, franchise deal. Um, so, yeah, that finished. A little monthly cost issue going on. We'll check the history on that. Uh, wow, that, uh, so yeah, that was our first one for the new, for the Nintendo Wii knockoff. Um, and hey, we made quite a bit of money on that. That's nothing to shake a Wii mote at, or a new mote. Uh, so yeah, <clears throat> excuse me. Uh, I guess we need to start a new game. Actually, I don't know. Um, let's just go back. Okay, no, we did have another... Wii game, but interesting. That one did really well. Military action uh, got in the top 21. This didn't do as well, uh, but it's a decent amount of money. And I think what our goal right now is we want to get to 100 million dollars, uh, so we can uh, we can get into the next office, and hopefully things will get much more exciting from there. Um, so I think I want to do a sequel. Uh, it might have to be a sequel of something old. Uh, I don't want to go from a computer game to a Wii game. Uh, we got to grab one of our uh, 64 games. So, hmm, Shiver These Timbers did not do well. Pirate Action is not a good combo, apparently. 64, okay, we got uh, Ninja Gaiden 2. might be time for new Ninja Gaiden. That didn't do badly. Uh, Saucers in Outer Space did not do particularly well. We can always continue on with a sequel of our Wild West action, Blue Alive Desperados. Um, and I might have to remember the rest of that song if we're going to do another one of that. Okay, we'll, we'll just see. We got um, 7,500 fans from that. We got 10,000 fans. Let's do another Ninja Gaiden. Everyone loves ninjas. And actually, I did pick at least a temporary name for my channel which ended up being everybody loves pirates because you know hey you do and it was kind of funny uh because hey if it's going to be a gaming channel uh focusing on games um and especially uh game dev which had their own little pirate run in uh which was kind of funny uh but hey, you know pirate means many things to many people and um i just hope no one thinks i uh support piracy because i don't so let's do uh ninja uh, guy Den 3. Um, oh, I wish we had our, our cinematic cutscenes in this engine, but I don't think we do. Uh, so, uh, why you birds hate me? Uh, there's all sorts of weird stuff going on with that, which you'll understand if you uh, played the Ninja Gaidens on the NES and um, also, if you've ever watched uh, Game Center CX, amazing, amazing show uh, in Japan, uh, you can get fan uh, subs of it over here. And they did some official stuff. It's uh, Retro Game Master. I highly recommend getting the DVDs from Amazon. Uh, but this is Ninja Action, right? Oh, nope. Man. Gonna take me a while to remember where everything is with our new blood engine, and you know it's for the Wii, so I think everyone is right. We don't want to do a mature game for the Wii. I just don't think that's gonna work. But we do need 3D graphics, so get on it, guys. Not bad. Oh, okay, good. I was like, I want to make sure that I did a medium game, but I didn't check. Good. I think we're at the point now where we can just use our basic settings. Oh, and that last time I ran through without putting physics in the game. I forgot to check over here, which I do a lot. Um, but I think from here on we can just hit OK. 
Edward is doing great with that tech. I'm doing pretty good with design. Getting some three bubbles over there. Uh, you know, Bertha's doing all right. She's, you know, for what she can do. She's not doing bad. Throwing some bugs over, but, you know. Hey, we'll take any bubble she wants to throw us. Uh, we'll take them, even the bugs. Okay, we're going to get into the last section here. I think I might um, advertise this game a bit. Soundtrack? Okay, so um, I don't know if I mentioned before. I think I did. Um, we're getting about to our limit for what we can do with how much time we're spending on sound. I'm going to bump sound out just enough to get that to 100%. Because sound is fairly important for these games. And, like I said, I'm going to market this uh, just kind of... Um, yeah, magazines and demos. We're not going to spend a lot on the marketing for this. It's going to stand on its own. It's going to do really well. I'm positive. Look at those bugs. Always almost hit finish. Almost like every time. Sorry, now there's a little silence. Trying to clear my throat without coughing into the mic. Okay, so let's see if we can get to 150 on design. That'd be nice. Not bad. I almost want to try to get it on tech. But we're throwing up some new bugs, so I'm just going to finish. Uh, new topics are popular. We're not doing new topics. Uh-oh. That shouldn't be a new bonus. Did I pick the wrong thing? I did ninja action, didn't I? Oh man, if I hit adventure instead, that could be bad. Um, but heck, we'll release it. We'll see what happens. Ah, uh, game history. Ninja action. Why was that new? Um, uh, where's, where's Ninja Gaiden 2? Ninja action. I don't know. Hey. Let's see. Okay, not bad. I like it. And so do they. So it looks like it's going to be 8s and 9s. I am very happy with that. I think our fans will be as well. We did them we did them right. Close. You can get us a game report which will teach us nothing new at all so maybe Bertha still needs some time uh, to figure out what she's doing. Uh, which is fine. Airplane research. I will research. Sorry, I always do that. Uh, ooh, werewolf action. Yeah, I'm not a fan of werewolves either. I, I'm just not a fun person, I guess. I don't like zombies, don't like werewolves. Don't want them in my games. I don't mind if they're there, just as long as I don't have to mess with them. Uh, like in Elder Scroll games. You know, if you want. If you want uh, Vampires and werewolves? Okay, fine. Just uh, don't make me become one, and we'll be cool. Hey, hey! We might make it to a million on this game. I hope we do. That law is not important. Uh, action for the news only okay. Interesting. Uh, but everyone loves ninjas. Or, er, yeah, it's good, but everyone does love ninjas. Okay, and let's see. What should we do? Should we just go straight into uh, another game? Did I do new game and not sequel? Is that what I did wrong? That's what I did wrong. Um, yeah, whatever. Uh, I'm pretty sure I did that. Uh, I really wish the clicking wasn't... I don't know. I often just try to click in the middle here to get this list, and it thinks I'm clicking on Edward. Okay, game history. It's not going to tell us whether it was a sequel or not. I think I forgot to do sequel. Which, on the bright side, means we can do a sequel this time. And we won't be doing back-to-back -back sequels. So let's do that. And maybe I did, and I just forgot, and oh well. Uh, how do we do with horrors? Oh, that's for the PC. Yeah, that's a mature game. Uh, saucers in outer space. Bad 2. Might be time for another bad. Golden Horn did not do well. I was hoping it would. 
Gurney Racing uh, didn't do well. It was a horrible combination. Uh, we could do a Gas sequel. That made it in the top five. Let's do a sequel to uh, Galaxy Alien Skirmishes, our space action game. Uh, okay, so Gas... Oh. Gas 2... Um, stars are giant balls of gas. Um, there we go. Uh, giant balls of gas. Medium space action. Yeah, last time we had to pick it, so I must have not done it. Good combo, not great. Put it on the new, even though it's not an amazing combination action games in the new. Uh, we're going to continue. We are not going to leave behind our fans from the Nintendo uh, consoles, except for the ones that bought the games here. Okay, let's go. We love our fans, and even if there's better uh, things to release on, we will. Uh, ooh, we might be able to get this in time to bump up our last game as well. Uh, how much for a large booth? 1.5? It's only three times as much. We got the cash. Um. It might end up being like a quarter of what this game makes. But I think we can actually get a lot of people to our booth now. I want to see how many people we can get with a large booth. Okay, we can just click through these. The nice thing, despite kind of making it boring. Um, but, yeah. Okay, no particularly strong segments, which is fine. I don't think we were developing towards one anyways. Drink a little sweet tea. Okay, continue on. Our guys will be ready for vacation after this game, I'm pretty sure. All right, here's our convention. We will get a little bump to Ninja Gaiden 3, uh, which is which is good stuff. Come on, over a million, not bad. Can we get top like 10 maybe? 11. You know, I'm going to take that. I will take that every day, all day, all week. Yeah, we're working hard. Let's get a vacation in after this game. You guys earned it. And they're saying, hey, you know what? We want a vacation. Uh, I hear that, um, what, that uh, Dominican Republic is nice this time of year? Uh, this time of year being July? Maybe Australia, that'd be nice. Southern Hemisphere, spring. Or winter. Um, okay, great. We ended up hitting a million, thanks to the convention. That got us over a million, which is awesome. Uh, I actually went to Australia uh, years and years and years ago. Um, it was really cool. I think it was, uh, it was during the rainy season. I think I think it was like fall in the northern hemisphere. So it was probably their spring. Uh, but it was great. Go to the Great Barrier Reef from a boat for a week. I uh, went to a, a uh, rainforest. Fun stuff. Sold 1 million units, generating almost 12 million in sales. Wow, you guys, yeah, you deserve a vacation. We're going to get design up to 150. I know you can do it. I know you can do it. See, I'm the only one that's going to add to this because these guys are pooped. So we'll let them go. New com Why is it new comboing me? Is it because it's a new system? It didn't do that before, did it? I mean, this is a sequel. I know we didn't do a new combo. Maybe it's because we can do dual genres now, and we have a pirate nothing mix. I don't know. Maybe it's a bug. Maybe I'm miss missing something. Doesn't bother me. Uh, you know what? Just go on vacation. I'll tell you the reviews later. They're going to be good. They're going to be great. Come on. Yes. Gas 2's giant balls of gas. Can we get all 10s? Our first all 10 game? Woo. Oh, come on. Come on. 
No! No! All games, you screwed me. That's okay. I will take a 9.75. Um, I'm just going to generate the game report while he's on vacation. Probably need to do some training. Oh, I, I should have done training before. Hey, new version of the original, which we would have got on the last game too had we done a sequel. Um, but we did. Oh, wow. We're going to hit a million in sales in our second week. Cool stuff. Okay, we're on a roll. Uh, we're going to get. Yeah. We're over 100 million easy. Uh, hopefully we can move now. I'm away to train so I can train at the better place. I don't know when they're going to let us move. Uh, might be when this game stops selling. We might want to develop one more while we're waiting because I don't want to blow the research points on training when I can train better later. Cool. Okay, maybe we'll just research uh, some topics. I think we got a couple topics left. Oh, that's it. That is all the topics. We don't have these four yet, but we've unlocked everything. And really, we unlocked a lot of the good action stuff at the beginning. Um, so that that wasn't too bad. We weren't really straining for good topics based on our development strengths. Um, yeah, so life, business, school, uh, fantasy actions, probably not a great combo, but, you know, hey, we'll do it. We'll work towards our next engine, too, since we have the time. Um, we are going to, you know, surround sound might not be a bad idea. Level design is important. Dynamic environment sounds good to me. Gameplay is important as well. Ooh, achievements, uh, everyone. Man, the people love those achievements. I'm not a big fan of achievements. I mean, they're okay. I, I like achievements when you have no idea what they are. Uh, you're just playing a game, and you do something really cool. Not, oh, hey, you know, you beat the game. You did the, the main storyline. Here's an achievement for doing that. Who cares? Everyone's going to do that probably. Or if you, that, That's its own goal. But like when you do so something strange in a game, when you're just kind of messing around, you do something strange, and you're like, oh, that was kind of cool. And then the game also does that. It recognizes that you did something kind of interesting and says, hey, achievement, you did this weird thing. You, you know, roped a panda with your lasso that you made out of uh, speaker wire. Uh, no one else, you know, would probably think to do that. Here's an achievement. That's that's kind of cool. Just recognition for doing something um, that's possible in the game, but not really um, what the game's looking to do. Because I like doing stuff like that. I always like kind of pushing the borders in games, making my own, uh, I don't know, making making just my own kind of fun, my own narrative, uh, my own goals. Wow, 62 million in sales. Ah, oh, we're still not moving yet. It almost makes me want to go look and see what the requirements are to move. It could be based on fans. Uh, maybe 500,000 fans. Well, well, we'll develop at least one more game here. Um, let's see. What haven't we done? Did we get our airplane action game yet? Let's, let's check our history. Um, ninja, racing... Military hunting action. Well, if we have done one, we haven't done it on the new. So let's do it. Uh, two, let's see. Medium game. Airplane. Action. Four. Sometimes those clicks do not activate. For the new with our new blood engine. Uh, what should it be? Um... Hmm. I do remember getting a game cartridge when I was a kid. A buddy of mine, uh, his mom was a flight attendant. Uh, and she flew overseas a lot and went to Japan. And she brought back this cartridge that had, um, what was it, 76 games in one cartridge. Uh, and a lot of them were Japanese games, which is kind of cool because I played a lot of Japanese games uh, that I recognize now um, from that show I was telling you uh, where the guy plays old retro games in Japan. 
uh, who is Japanese, so he plays some of this stuff. But uh, one of them was you were a Japanese Zero fighter in World War II, and you're building up American planes. Uh, it was a lot of fun. Uh, but it was kind of weird as a kid uh, to be doing that. Let's see. Oh, man. I've, I've lost my ability to do cool stuff. So um, maybe we do our Call of Duty. Uh, we do... Um, uh, flying duty um, hmm waste waste them not great but let's go I think that was everyone which is fine Get in some good pre pre development. I like it. We got some physics now for our our flight game. Our hype should be good. We got a lot of fans. We might um oh goody. Pre advertising. I will take it. I will interview. Um can you tell us whether such a game would receive more focus on dialogue or engine? Definitely the engine. You are welcome, eGaming Chat. Hey, we're in the era of online um, reviewing, which is awesome. Everyone agrees with me. Stage two, I'm going to wait till stage three. Uh, we'll do a big push on ads. We're not going to get the convention bump this time around, I don't think. I kind of wonder, I was, I was thinking this, does it, does it help to wait one, maybe for a convention. Oh, wow, we will get the convention. Sweet. We did wait around for quite a while. So is it better to not develop right away? Wait and make sure that you get it in convention again? The last time we had two games going at once. Ah, yeah, bugs. Um, oh, and we're at the end of this development cycle almost. I'm, I'm going to put her... I'm going to put her on it right away. It's going to hurt this game a tiny bit, uh, but she doesn't She doesn't contribute a ton to the project. Oh, wow, this is the end. Oh, man, I thought we had one more. I would have waited. Oh, well, live and learn. We'll do a small campaign, which is half a million dollars. You know, see, we still almost got to 150 without her help. She's just going to be throwing bugs. She hasn't done a lot of games with us. You know, it's actually it's probably fine now, but her her contribution will go up. She's she's fit in. She's a part of the team now. Yeah. So we're not going down. That's good. Number one booth. All right. Very good. We should definitely move soon. I train these guys up anyways. I love companies like Action Gaming Limited or Games Limited. They don't just milk their customers for more money, but they also understand our concerns and make sure that we can enjoy our games. And I agree. Hey, um, mistakes happen. Some companies just love to push out stuff that's unfinished. And like, oh, we'll just fix it later. We got to get it out during this season. Uh, but, you know, hey, it happens legitimately too. And, um, yeah, I really appreciate those companies that fix their games right away. And there's other ones that don't, and you end up having to download fan patches just to be able to play the game, which is kind of ridiculous. Make your fans fix your game for you. No names. I'm not going to say anyone. You know. Reviews are in. Oh, no. Hmm. Quirky, but good. Hey, you're going to have these, I think, no matter what. I think the way this game is, just does it, occasionally you're not going to have amazing scores. There's a random number generator in there somewhere. And you know what? That's not a bad game. We'll, we'll gain some fans from that. Not a ton. We'll make some money from that. Maybe didn't need to spend half a million dollars on advertising it. Oh, I missed whatever the trends were. I do not pay attention to that at all. So, you know what? I am going to train us. 
Um, I really want to get to uh, get in the 700s and get a specialization. That will definitely help at our next place. So I'm going to stick with design for me. Research, uh, oh, not research. Uh, train technology for Eddie Baby. And Bertha, you know, I thought I was going to fire her, and now I just, I don't know. We got half a million. Not bad. We're going to have her, if we have the points for it, research for the next engine. The benefits to training here is it doesn't cost as much. I mean, those options are, the same options are available in the next place, but then you get better options as well. Uh, but they cost more research points. Um, okay. See, we don't really have any story quest stuff. We don't really do world design. We don't do dialogue. Uh, we do 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 uh, gameplay. We don't really need character progression or skill trees for the stuff we're doing, but we might do a combo deal later, and they might not be bad to pick up. We do want something for the, we do want engine stuff though. Um, I don't really care about the online stuff right now. We don't need AI companions. Uh, sounds good. We don't have the research points for it though. Uh, graphics. So we definitely want that, but we're going to have to save up for it. We need 3D graphics version 5 for our triple A stuff. I did um I did see that. Um of course we're not going to be putting out triple A stuff uh anytime soon, but let's just grab video playback. And she'll get Wow, we're both scratching our heads on our training. That was that was hard training, huh? Oh wow, we might hit a million sales on Flying Duty, despite our scores. And we're over half a million fans. Nice. Woohoo! And I kind of been skipping over the other stuff. Tablets and phones, who cares? I'm not a big fan of tablet gaming or phone gaming. Like little puzzle games and stuff for that, but I don't really want to play like a real game on any of it. Oh man, why can't we leave? We got 150 in cash. I know we don't need another employee because I've gone to the other place with three people before. Oh, I like that. The little post it notes making the, uh, the invaders guys in Tetris. That's pretty cool. First time I noticed that. Not bad. Okay. We're going to put these guys on a quick vacation. It's not going to take them very long. The Woo! So we're almost, wow, we're almost to current era. And we're still in this office. This is a how not to play of this game, apparently. Hmm. Okay, let's wait for him to get back from vacation. Edward is back. Bertha's going to take a little longer vacation. Use up some sick days. There we go. Uh, new game. Pick a topic. It's not going to be a good combo. Let's do fantasy action. Action RPG. We don't have any of the engine stuff for an RPG at all. No, let's just do action. New. I really just want to leave and go somewhere else and hire a ton of people. Um, mm. And then we could do we could publish uh, large games. Um, I mean, maybe we could do that here. I, mean, I just need to hire people. Oh man, what a pain! What a pain. Okay, so fantasy action game. Um, what would that be? I don't even know what a fantasy action game would be. You know, you think fantasy, you, see, you think like uh, dragons and stuff and wizards and um, yeah, I just don't know. Ooh, um, I'm gonna do one called. It 
That's not right. Is that Icarus? Kid Icarus? Um. Let's do Jerry. Man, I'm, I'm picking stuff I can't even spell. Jerry Actric. Jerry Actric. Um, no, I'm actually going to look that up. Jerry Act Trick. Uh, yeah, I spelled that right. Amazing. Icarus. Spell that right too. It just doesn't look right. Okay. Jerry Act Trick Icarus. So it's an old wizard, um, that uh, flew too close to the sun, apparently. And yeah, it's got all sorts of. Oops. Nasty moles and stuff from sun damage. Okay, we'll keep all the same sliders. I mean, maybe it's a time for a big switch. I mean, we're a hit. We're the, we're the number one booth now for action. We are the action gaming company. Why are we still here? I'm gonna have to check that out uh, for the next video. Oh, and we're at 30 minutes. Um, yeah, I'm gonna let this finish uh, developing. And I'll put in a cut, and we can come back, see what the scores are, uh, and see uh, what's going to happen. So let's just bang these bugs out real quick. Oh, wow. We had a whole other development stage. I'm just not paying attention, apparently. Um, we'll market this. 500 grand. We're build building decent hype just based on our fans. I kind of thought we'd have... We waited a little bit. I thought we'd have a... Another convention, but we didn't. So, 126 hype. Uh, did we designed this one a lot better? We did train our guys. That helped. Lots of bugs. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Blast off. Okay. And the woo's out. Wow. Already. Okay. Wow. Ooh. Spend a little more time polishing this. Nah. Okay. New topic, new combo. That one definitely was. Yay! Edward. I'm going to give you a raise. Virtual economy. Okay, now it's. I almost kind of wanted to start developing a new game uh, to get the convention boost. There's no reason not to. Um, let's do a sequel to one of our old 64 games. Um, wow. Okay, share these timbers, Ninja Gaiden, Saucers in Outer Space. Um, yeah, I guess we got to throw out a bad three. We owe our fans. Uh, we could go back further, do another superfluous terrestrial game. Um, fans of that have been waiting a long time. Ooh, 14 years? Uh, the Duke Nukem 3D of uh, Nintendo games? I don't think we'll go back that far. Uh, this is just over 10 years. Yeah, it's time. Okay. Bad. Three. Um, oh man! Don't be a hard one to continue on the song. New blood, medium. Everyone, everyone loves the Wild West. Mm. Reviews. Oh, okay. Nice. Who knew people want to play as an old guy flying around sh shooting eggplants? Being turned into one by someone that looks like an eggplant, right? It turned you into an eggplant, but weren't the wizards also eggplants? I can't remember. That was so long ago. You know, I think what I'm thinking of, uh, which is probably accurate, which probably means it's true. 
uh, is the Captain N uh, Game Master or whatever it was, the old cartoon. Uh, sorry, I'm talking to all the 30-year-olds out there. Um, but hey, if you're uh, younger, if you're um, you know teenager or whatever, uh, go check it out. The Nintendo had a uh, animated series, uh, Captain N. Or I guess was that part of the? I think Captain N was its own thing. There's a Super Mario Super Show, but I don't think it showed that cartoon. I think it was its own thing. I don't know, it's been a long time, but I'm sure it's on YouTube or something. Check it out. Pause my video. I don't care. Cool. We were the number one booth again. So great. We had a lot of hype for Bad 3. We get some good sales on Geriactic um, Icarus. Already got 500,000, half a mil. We will easily hit a million in sales. We might hit two because we're getting that bump now. Yeah, maybe. Maybe not. One million in sales! It's platinum! Our competitors are jealous. They've been heard murmuring jealous, jealousness. Envious jealousness. Okay, and you know what? Um, I don't think we're trying to get to a cash number now. I really don't. Uh, I, oh, man, I forgot to cut this video. I'm going to cut the video now. Um, come back if you're enjoying it, and I will see you soon.